They're young, energetic and out of the classroom for a week. Hi, I'm Ruby Spinkin in Vicargill at Bushy Point Reserve, where the Year 7 Southland Girls High School students are doing their annual community breakout. They're learning about conservation. They're in here at Bushy Point. We've been uh, stomping around clearing plants so that they can be sprayed and, and, and released and allow the sunlight to get at them to grow better. And they're also experiencing planting trees, which is probably really, really important because they will be able to come back in 10, 20, 50 years time and say, you know, I planted those. But they're not only planting and caring for new forests. Year 7 teacher Elaine McAvoy says over the week they're learning about financial literacy, taking art programs, orienteering, going to the library and doing a beach clean. She says this week is a great experience for the girls. Um, we've been doing this for a long time in Year 7 and 8 and it's a chance for the girls to go out into the community and see what the community has to offer and also to help along the way and we have people coming in to talk to the girls from the community as well and it's just a chance because a lot of our girls come from outside of Invercargill as well and they're not always aware of what we have on offer here in the city so it's a really nice time for them to, it's a whole citizenship based week. Barry Smith says although the girls aren't spending a long time at the reserve, their contributions go a long way. And although they um, only get a few minutes doing each particular little task, what we have in the end is a number of hours of work, probably a hundred odd hours of work that's gone and put in by these young ladies, and that means that's a hundred hours of work we don't have to do. <laughs> and it makes it a lot easier. <laughs> Elaine McAvoy says it's a great bonding experience for these girls who are in their first year at a new school, and it gets them connected with the community. I'm Ruby Spink for The South Today.